Hey everyone, it's about, uh, I don't know, let me see real quick. It's about 10.38 right now, and, um, it snowed this morning, and it's been snowing for a long time. I mean, it's not snowing anymore, but, uh... Um, I just wanted to say that that car that's moving, do you see right there, over there, over there, it was actually just sitting there for about, uh, five minutes, which, I mean, maybe, you know, he was just stopping in the middle of the road, he got a text, but, like, for five minutes... I mean, it's not, this road is decently busy, like, it's kind of inconsistent, like, right now it's probably not going to see another car for about 20 minutes now, and then, like, uh, in two days, because there's no school tomorrow, but, um, it's going to be real busy throughout the whole day, so yeah, I mean, it, earlier at, like, uh, say about, two in the afternoon there are like these two cars just sitting um like down here down where that uh and that's that's kind of weird but whatever um anyways guys just wanted to share that with you it's been a it's been a nice little day here in uh, Thornton Colorado Um, the creepiest thing that's happened to me here at these apartments was, uh, probably one time in, and sorry I haven't been uploading recently, I really have not been, uh, just inspired to make videos, I feel like I just don't want to make videos. Uh, yeah, I, I'm probably just being lazy, that's it, but, uh, I just don't, I have video ideas, like, favorite player from every NBA team, like I did with the NHL, but... You know, and like uh, I could just talk about um, NBA and shit like that. Uh, but, anyways, um, the scariest thing that's ever happened to me here was in the middle of the day. It was like five, six ish. That's not the middle of the day. That's uh, evening. It's like a, that's a, yeah, that's a plane, don't worry. It's not some, uh, aliens trying to invade me and turn me into Mormons or something. But, um, I, uh, I really, oh yeah, so it was like six, and, um, I think my mom was out, like, with her friends or something. Yeah, yeah. She went to like an Alice Cooper concert or something like that with her friend. Um and uh I heard like someone trying to get in. Obviously, I had the door locked, but someone was like um turning the knob on the door like as if they were trying to open it. And I luckily I didn't have the TV on. And there was only one light on, but I I then realized I uh, looked over and they were doing the same thing to my neighbor's door, and it was it was just some uh, punk kid who was um who was trying to like see if there was any unlocked doors. So um, that was kind of weird. Uh, another scary thing is. In these apartments, I have, like, a full view. And one time, I was talking to my dad. This was actually fairly recently. I'd say it was in, like, September. Um, so I just... I like looking outside. I get it from my grandma. I don't know why. I just, like, you know, looking deep outside. And then I look down. Like, down there, it was, like down there kind of where uh you can't see it here down th down there yeah 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 and i saw some uh some two dudes like two dudes in a uh, clown like i couldn't even tell it looked like they were wearing masks um and they had like hoodies on 
and um, what they did was one of them was like this to the other one who was uh, behind him. He was like this. He was like this. He was like, God, I'm gonna have to put my. He was like this. He was like, like, like that, like that. Okay. And I was on the phone with my dad, and I backed up, and I was like, holy shit, dad, I just saw, and I described to him what I saw, and then I went to my mom's room, and I was like, mom, I just saw this, blah, 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 and then, um, I heard a knock on my door, and I was like, oh my god, and I grabbed a kitchen knife, and I looked out the eye hole, um, See, like, look at this. Do you see that car? The red lights that are moving? They might just stop. You know what? They're probably just going so slow because it's, like, icy. Um, I shouldn't be like, oh, my God, it's a ghost car. Ghosts don't know how to drive very well. Um, so, uh... What was I saying? And I and I looked I grabbed like a kitchen knife and I looked out the peephole and I was like, I think that's my friend Jamal. Which uh I've known him for about three years. I don't know why I brought that up, but um yeah, I uh I saw him and I was like, dude and I told him what happened and uh he he was like, Yeah, I saw two dudes, but they were just going to some guy's car. So, yeah, I mean, I haven't, the next scariest thing I've seen here, <sighs> okay, it wasn't specifically at these apartments, but there's a dollar store really, really close to here, so do you see over where that big light is, it's shining down on the pavement? That's the middle school I go to, and I, I literally have to just cross the street to get over there, and if you go up, and then turn... Okay, oh crap. So over there, I'm gonna zoom in. Actually, I can't. Actually, I can. You see where all those light? All right, that green, that green light right there. That's like where the dollar store is, which is about like half a mile away from me. So I was just walking there to get some uh, like snacks and some new headphones. Uh, yeah, I I was desperate. Uh, but really, I mean. If you're poor and you have like seven dollars laying around, if you treat these headphones good, these dollar store headphones good, they can last up to about a month for a dollar, which is pretty cool. So I went over there and it was like 6 p.m. on a Sunday. For some reason, I despise Sundays because I get this really weird feeling. And all the sitcoms are on, and all the football games are on. And when I see that, I'm just like, ugh, Sunday. And it's almost hard to enjoy Sunday without beloved video games. Which, um, sometimes I didn't have that when I was grounded. And this was one of the times, so I was... I don't want to sound like a little baby, like, oh my god, it was Sunday, and I didn't have video games. I went insane. No, I was just like, oh, bleh, tomorrow there's school. But I don't feel like that today, because tomorrow there's no school. And it's a uh, off day for some reason, because I was like, oh, well, Veterans Day, but that's today. Also, by the way, the Avalanche beat the Oilers 4-1. to Finally, we won a game in, like... A while. Anyways, um, so to uh, to be frank with you, um, around that night time, the homeless people usually like to find somewhere to sleep. So they're all walking around, and I'm uh, I'm talking about homeless people like they're these fucking monsters, which they're not. Uh, I'm sorry, I sh I just licked my microphone. Um, but no. Uh, there were these homeless, there was this homeless lady, and she, I, she walked by me, and it, her face, w it looked like she got stung by, a, like, 500 bees, um, and I was like, 
and I I wanted to say, "Ma'am, are you okay?" And I did. Is that my? Sorry, that's my little uh thing there I got from my grandmother. I got this. Um, I'm, I was gonna make an inappropriate joke there, but um, nope, no, no. Uh. Anyways. So basically, I, um, God, what was I, okay, so I asked the old homeless woman, are you okay? And she said, I'm sorry. And she had a normal old woman voice. She was like, I, I'm sorry. I can't, I'm sorry. I can't do an old woman voice. It was, except it sounded like she just smoked like a cigarette or something. Um, but she uh, did have like a Marlboro pack in her pocket or whatever. So she uh, said, I asked her, are you okay? And she said, I'm fine. I just got my thing stolen. And I got beat up. And I realized... This is what it's like to be a homeless person, you know. You you might get like some food and you stock up and you're like, "All right, well, I'm I'm full right now. I have this extra, I don't know, fill in the McDonald's." And I and I want to make sure nobody steals it. So they just put it under a blanket. Well, the old woman, she was like, "Yeah, my she was like, yes, my food got stolen, and they punched me, and I was like, wow, I'm, I hope you get better, and I, it's n after I think about it, it's really not that creepy. It, it's just sad. You know, I mean, there's a cop over there for uh, some reason. I'm, uh, is that even a cop? No, that's not a cop. That's like garbage day or, or something. Hmm. Anyways. Um. So basically. Gosh, I gotta rest my arm. My arm hurts. It's been holding up a phone for 12 minutes now. Um, I, that's just really sad because, you know, as a homeless person, you could get your stuff stolen. You know? I mean, yeah, there's homeless shelters, but those, like, kick you out after, like, you get, you sleep there, get breakfast, leave. Move on to the next one. So I just felt bad. I saw some more homeless people. Um, but, yeah, I mean, that's that's pretty sad. Anyways, thanks for watching uh, Scary Time. Yeah, that's what I'm going to call this piece of garbage series. Scary Time. This channel sucks.